This morning, the state's attorney's office brought by criminal information three additional counts against Jeffrey Price in case number 2017, CF255. Those additional counts are counts two, three, and four, which alleged first degree murder against Mr. Price and the death of the minor infant EM that, that occurred on June 19, 2017. But I guess before I go any further, I'd like to announce the other members up here with me from my office. And to my far right, I have Matt Kidder, Mr. Greg Sticka, and then to my left is Investigator Callahan from the Marseilles Police Department, who I would like to acknowledge and thank for his prompt work in this matter so that the case was brought to us. The three charges against Mr. Price are all in the alternative. The first count is first degree murder, in that the said defendant, without lawful justification and with the intent to kill or do great bodily harm to EM, whose date of birth is 6-10-2017, struck and impacted the head of EM multiple times, thereby causing the death of EM. This is all in violation of Section 5-9-1A1 of Chapter 720 of the Illinois Compiled Statutes. The third count, which was filed this morning, alleges again in the alternative first degree murder in that the said defendant, without lawful justification, struck and impacted the head of EM, date of birth again, 6-10-2017, multiple times, knowing such act would cause the death of EM, thereby causing the death of EM. The fourth and final count that was filed this morning is first degree murder in that the said defendant, without lawful justification, struck and impacted the head of EM, date of birth 6-10-2017, multiple times, knowing such act created a strong probability of death to EM, thereby causing the death of EM, pursuant to section 5 slash 9-1A2 of chapter 720 of the Illinois Compiled Statutes. These charges could bring for Mr. Price 20 to 60 years. And again, as always, the defendant is entitled to a presumption of innocence, and it's our burden to prove him guilty. At one point in time in our state history, this could have been capital eligible. Is the possibility of natural life on the table? Right now, we're looking at 20 to 60. Natural life could come into play if a finder of fact finds a brutal or heinous act. Any idea why the judge uh, halted you, Mr. Sticker, when you tried to make a factual basis in open court? Uh, we have no comment on that. I mean, we were present in open court. Um, and obviously, this, these were counts that were added after an original count of aggravated battery of a child. So. We heard that Mr. Price may not be from our sales. Is that where you guys listen to him as his home, or is there another town? Uh, we are showing an address of 235 Clark Street in Marseilles. So we are showing a Marseilles address at the time of the incident. And what is uh, Mr. Price's date of birth? February 25th, 1987. Was there a blood or familial relationship between the suspect and the victim? That we can't comment on at present time. He does have his bond set at $5 million. Is Mr. Price employed? He has applied for the assistance of the public defender, so I, I don't know whether he's employed or not. <clears throat> but uh, he was not married to the victim's mother, correct? That we can't comment on, and as far as the question with regard to whether he's employed, his affidavit of assets and liabilities, which are in the court file and public record, show that he is not employed. Do you anticipate any further charges against Mr. Price? Not at the present time, you know, until the investigation develops and we get further information brought before us, but this is what we <clears> have right now. Did you personally make the arrest? No, I didn't. But was he arrested by Marseilles uh, PD? That's good. Okay. Do we have a date of that original arrest? Was so that before the, I mean, the, He the was, matter happened on the 19th. So. Right. He was brought up to court on an aggravated battery of a child case on June 21st of 2017. So, so that was the original charge. Mm -hmm. 
um, the, the child at issue EM was still alive at that point in time. Yes. On the 21st. But was he arrested on the 20th or 21st, or do you have that information? He would have been formally arrested um, like a day prior to okay. that. Okay. 